Step one, brace yourself. Before you begin, expect dirty palms, expect scraped knees, expect failure and frustration. It's not going to be easy. Falling down is an essential part of this process. It will be okay. I know it hurts, but believe me when I say, this pain is only temporary. Step two, balance. You're now at the edge of your comfort zone because the training wheels are coming off. Those warm hands that used to gently guide you and push you off are gone. We are living, so therefore we are growing. And sometimes our minds, our spirits, outgrow those around us and our old complacent self. Ask yourself, are you really happy in your comfort zone? Step three, pedal. One foot at a time and one push at a time till you get a steady rhythm. Whatever you do, Keep moving forward, and don't focus on what's behind you. Ice forward, chin up. Step four, steering. Ultimately, you decide where you go. When your knees hit the ground and there's one too many scratches, you can decide to stop trying, stay down, and stop pedaling. But this causes you to remain stagnant, comfortable on the ground. Or you can decide to get up and try again. This choice requires more work, more failure, but at the same time, it gives you a chance. A chance at success. A chance at moving forward and growing. Step five, learning from the past, Scars, they cover your body. They are your warrior marks, and you should wear them proudly because they make you who you are. They taught you important lessons. Forgive what happened in the past, but never forget it. Don't let it hinder your performance today. Continue pedaling. Step six, believe. No matter how long it takes, days, months, a year, believe that you are enough. You have what it takes to accomplish this daunting task. You're strong enough, smart enough. Realize you've come this far on this beautiful journey. Never give up and believe. And maybe, Just maybe. You'll do the unthinkable. <laughs>